Siri, Alexa, and Google Home make our lives a bit easier. These voice assistant devices are like friends you can depend on. But are they the kind of friend who would stab you in the back, gossip, tell the world your secrets? The answer is possibly so. And that has raised concerns among privacy advocates because the voice assistant devices can record and collect personal information from users. Information that can come back to haunt them. But are users concerned about privacy? According to a 2019 study from UC Berkeley, out of 116 Amazon and Google smart speaker owners, about 72% were not concerned about being recorded by their voice assistants. However, about 14% were concerned about the devices recording their children. About 8% were concerned about the devices recording their guests. Voice assistants are only supposed to activate and respond to fake words like, hey Siri, Alexa, or okay Google. However, a 2020 report from Northeastern University found that the devices accidentally activate up to 19 times a day and record up to 43 seconds of audio each time. Depending on how you use them, Siri, Alexa, and Google Home can have access to various apps on your phone, such as your contacts, location, Apple Pay, and social media, according to Apple and Google. So, what's wrong with that? Well, these voice assistant devices record and listen to private information, such as intimate conversations, medical history, business deals, etc. And companies from the apps on your phone can collect this data and use it against you. How? Public places like grocery stores, movie theaters, hotels, subways, etc. have beacons. Beacons are devices that identify your specific location and send information to your apps, such as the apps connected to your Siri, Alexa, or Google Home. It then allows companies to build a profile on your personal data, such as your socioeconomic status, your race, your gender, and your overall lifestyle. That's according to the New York Times. Companies can then use this data to make judgments about you. For example, say you go to the store and buy some cookies and grape soda. The beacons in the store can send the data of what you bought to the apps connected to your voice assistants. From there, companies can sell that data to your insurance company and say that you're unhealthy because of what you bought and raise your insurance rates, thus taking money out of your pocket. So what's being done about this? Consumer advocacy groups are pushing for the U.S. federal government to pass laws that protect consumers' personal data from being collected and sold by companies. Also, the Electronic Frontier Foundation are suing AT&T for tracking customers' locations. How can you protect your privacy? To stop Alexa and Google Home from listening to you, you can go in your settings and delete the recordings. You can also press the mute button and unplug them when you're not using them. To stop Siri from listening, go in your settings and tap Turn Off Siri. To stop the apps connected to the voice assistant from tracking you, you can go in your settings and disable their permission to use things like your location, microphone, and camera. Take back your control and reclaim your privacy.